channel. Um, if you're brand new, my name is Jordan Louise. Welcome to the Jules fam. Um, all my socials will be on the screen if you want to follow me. I have been posting quite a lot recently um, over on my TikTok and my Instagram and also my Facebook. Um, so today's look, if you can tell, um, is Cinder Disney Cinderella <laughs> at Lily James. Um, so yesterday last, night, yesterday last night I watched the film because I just really wanted to and it inspired, inspired me to do this look. I absolutely love it. I love that it's just flawless, just elegant looking. I do have like this dress which is a machine. If I can find it, I'll pop it in, in the description down below. But yeah, this is the look, the hair. It's very girly, very me as well. <laughs> but um, let's just get straight into the video. Um, I'm just going to do my hair first. Um, I curled my hair yesterday, but I've washed them out this morning. So the I like the natural curls, so I'm just going to go by my reference photo, uh, which I just have me iPad here. Um, so I'm just going to go by the hair look on that. So from what I see in the photo, it's more pulled back and you've got like a massive braid on the top, but it is kind of really curly. But um, I'm just going to go for natural curls for this look. So I'm going to start off with the braid because it looks like these bits have been hidden by that so for the braid I'm gonna get about from here maybe so I'm just gonna grab like a big chunk of hair <laughs> see how that goes right, I'm just going to I just basically made this a bit more bigger and chunkier just gonna do that again. So I'm just taking those underneath. Just got this and I'm just going to conceal that. Just like so and now we're just going to pull that apart just to make it a bit more bigger and fluffier and then should be able just to take that across like that and then we're going to pin this down Take a haircut and just pin that just like so, and then just gonna pin it this side down. I'm gonna do actually, I'm gonna pull the hairband down a bit. We've got just like that so far and we're going to remove that just like so so we've got like a sort of a crown at the top <laughs> I'm gonna take the front sections just gonna brush that out And just about down here, I'm going to twist that back. I'm going to twist that. So just like so. So we just basically twist it aside and we're just going to pin that back. That actually looks so pretty. Right now I'm just going to do this into the side. Just 
so pretty, my god. We're gonna slightly tuck, tuck, <laughs> just slightly pull that forward a bit. As the hairstyle, that was actually pretty quick and simple. Yeah, so let's just wand to the makeup. Prepping my skin first, I'm just taking my Pixie Rose Tonic. This is my absolute favourite tonic I've ever bought ever. <laughs> it's one of my favourites. So I'm just taking a little cotton pad and I'm just going to go over my face and just wipe away any residue, any oiliness that is on my left of my skin, just to help have a nice base. Uh, going in with my um, one of my favourite moisturisers as well, you guys know it's my favourite, it's the Nivea Soft Professionally Soft Moisturising Cream. I'm just taking it all over and making sure that's all patted into the skin nicely. For primer, I'm just using my Too Faced Peach and Primed. This is the best I've ever used ever. I'm just going to still put that over and make sure that is all blended into my skin nicely as well. Um, I'm just taking some eyelash curlers as Lily James aka Ella in the movie has some really nice lushes. Is that what? Lushes, lashes. So I'm just taking those for an extra set just as a nice curl and then just going to spray over with my favourite spray ever. Now that we've finished prepping the skin, I'm just taking my trusty 24 hour Maybelline New York foundation. This is my the best like full foundation that I've always used, but um, I'm just only going to take a little bit of that onto the skin and just lightly blend that around because a little does a lot and plus some um, Ella has literally flawless skin in the film. So I'm literally just taking a little bit and I'm just going to blend that all down the face, neck, nose, mouth, forehead, all the good stuff. <laughs> Taking my Elvet 16 Hour Camo Concealer, um, Ella does have literally, as I've said already, flawless skin, so I'm just going to take that underneath my eyes just to hide a bit of coverage and just also I'm going to put some, some natural highlight as well. I'm just going to put that on my chin, my nose, and just whatever else that, want, that hits the light. Going in with my Peach Perfect Loose Powder, I'm just going to lightly um, just put that on my chin and on my nose and any other places that are just a little bit oily. My lips did get a little bit dry throughout this video so I just did apply some uh, lip balm just on my lips to moisturise them. Next going into eyebrows, um, I just take my Revolution Pro Prow Pomade, I'm just going to lightly fill in my eyebrows because the eyebrows are so natural and a lot more full looking so I literally just add a bit of colour into them and just to make it um, fluffier at the top of the brow and then I'm just going to do the same to the other side. To set the brows in place, I am just taking my Rimmel London Insta Fix and Go Setting Spray and I'm just going to brush the eyebrows up and just make it sure it's all in place. Going in my bronzer, which is the Kiko Milano Flawless Fusion in the shade 6. I'm just going to lightly put some dimension on my face just because um, she didn't really have much contour going on in, in the movie. But I just um, chisel out my jaw a bit and also did the nose contour as you will see that is about to come up. Okay. 
Um, so for the contour, I am just uh, dragging that down the size of the nose to make it a bit more wider. And then I'm just going to drag that down just underneath the nose, just to make that a lot more um, elongated and just a bit more wider as well. And then on the tip of the nose, um, just underneath, I'm just going to make sure to contour that out just to make it sure it has like a lot more of a flattened look. For blush, I'm just taking my W7 Life's a Peach blush palette and just using the shade Melba and I'm just going to stick with that on the apples of my cheeks. For highlight, I'm just taking my Fenty Beauty um, Diamond Bomb Highlighter. This is so amazing, it's so glittery as well, um, especially in the movie. She has a lot of like glitter going on in her hair and also on her face and I thought this was like a nice product to use for this look. Uh, for the eyes, I'm actually using a new palette. This is the Olivia Hale um, Usher palette. Um, there is no names for them, so um, the shade that I use really is just like a shimmery brown. Because um, in the movie, you just have sort of like a shimmery god gold tones going on the eyes. So I literally just use this eyeshadow just over the lid and I'm just going to blend that out into the crease. Uh, for my mascara, I'm just using the Mega Volume Miss Baby Roll, uh, uh, Baby Roll Mascara by L'Oreal Paris. This is such an amazing mascara. It really makes my eyelashes so long and fluttery, um, especially for this look as well, which I absolutely adore. Uh, taking my um, Revolution uh, London lipstick, this is just in the shade Lust, this is a beautiful lipstick this is. I'm just going to apply that to the top of my lips and then just slightly on the bottom as well, I'm just going to rub those together as we just want in like a more of a tint to the lips, more than a fill on lipstick, <laughs> if, you, if you guys get what I mean. So yeah, if you see what I'm doing in the video, I'm literally just lightly putting that on and just rubbing my lips together to make sure it's a nice luscious look. And for the ending, I'm just spritzing out with my Insta Fix and Go setting spray. so much <laughs> um go hit the subscribe button if you haven't already to join the jewels fan and um, hit the notification bell to be notified whenever i upload and also give it a massive thumbs up if you want to or a dislike just shows me what you guys like and don't so yeah i absolutely love this look <laughs> see you guys in my next video bye my jewels